कारण व्हाट I'm here ready. Hey, hi. Yeah, we are going to go through a simple calibration. Yeah, but this won't be theoretical. It's just a process through which we are going to just see what takes place. I think uh, let me just place it here where you can see. I'm here, Adventure, Serundoji, Adventure, Justin. How are you? Uh, Sasha, I'll bring the plastic bag. Yeah, just taking through a quick service because I'm about to open my shift. I'm about to start my shift. That's why ah, I'm starting. <laughs> I like to see. I like to see. So these are my towels, cleaning towels. And I just have to carry this to fix it. <laughs> Lights, no more Wayne scale, it's a must. It has to be there. Okay. So just uh, switch on the temper, switch on the Wayne scale, assemble everything. Okay. So quickly, just in case you have a question about anything, you can easily ask. You can easily ask. This is my brain over here. And thank God. Okay, I'll just twist it a little to see the grain over there. And my tilt over here. How to calibrate Gagia Vistro machine? I think I've not yet used a uh, Gagia machine. And there is the video that you have ever made about size of cup and amount of espresso should be used. I think I've not yet I've not yet recorded a video about the cups, but it depends which cup. Like you see, I have some kinds of cups here. This is a six ounce cup. This is a six ounce cup, basically for the mm -hmm. flat white. Uh, okay, where is the small cup? The small cup. Okay. So first, I'll just cut it off. Stop testing. All right, so guys, I think I'm having a call. Let me first pick this call. So the first shot I don't test, yeah, that, that, uh, the first shot I don't test, but the second I do test. I think I don't need too much calibration out of this coffee because it's just giving me the perfect espresso that I was trying to calibrate that I was going to look for. So I don't need to over calibrate it, but let me see when I test it in the milk beverage, what it's going to be for me. Go. 
Yeah. You also forgot? <laughs> yeah. No, it's okay. We we'll all forget. By the way, my cappuccino or my milk beverage, just in case I come to your coffee shop, it has to be 45 to 55 degrees. I don't take more than that temperature. So I'm going to test. I don't need a lot of art in it. Wow. It's just perfect. It's really perfect. Now, uh, now let me tell you something, barista. Sometimes you might reach at your machine and the temperature, the weather, everything is just perfect, like today. I tried calibrating. I wanted to calibrate my machines, my grinders, but to my surprise, when I tested my coffee, it was really perfect. It was really nice. So sometimes the temperatures can be perfect to them coffee and you don't really need to test too much of your espressos or your milk beverages like today i calibrated just the second shot it gave me what i was looking for so sometimes you don't need to always test your coffee test your coffee to look for that test just in case you reach your grinders and your machines and they are giving you the espresso that you are going to look for just stop there start serving and in the middle of the shift or in the quarter session of the shift just do it just test your coffee or recalibrate your machine to see whether it has changed but today i am not going to take on any further calibration just because my machine has given me what i was looking for so just in case you have a question i think you need a lecture about size of cups amount of espresso and types of drinks no problem i think of uh, i have a video about uh, ristretto espresso lungo then i have a video about flat white cortado and a cappuccino I've not yet made a video about uh, latte, uh, uh, different uh, Americano, different beverages, but the size of cups, we have two O's, four O's, uh, six O's, eight O's, 12 O's, 18 O's, 16 O's. It depends on what uh, measurement your coffee shop wants to do. What? It depends on the recipe of your coffee shop, but we have a variety. So like you see, this is a four O's cup, but halfway it's going to give you uh, two O's, which is espresso, and if it's full with milk, it's going to be a cortaldo. So I think uh, that's it. I'm going to start my shift, and uh, I'm really sorry for I being lost. We have been opening up our nice coffee shop. So, like you see, let me take you through a quick one. These are my machines. This is the cold brew tower. These are the two grinders. This is the tamper, and this is our lamazoko. Like you see, it, it's a group three group head. Uh, this is my ice cream machine. This guy is called Sasha. Say hi. Hello, guys. <laughs> Ayua, so these are my craft brew territory. I've not yet arranged. Jonathan, say hi. Hello, Ayua. Ayua, that's Jonathan, the guy I work with. <laughs> He's among my best. This is our cashier section. And uh, this is our sitting room, like you see. This is our sitting room. It's just perfect. This is what my boss did. This is Destination 35, like you see that, Destination. 35 and uh let me take you through up these are the stairs these are the stairs so just in case you're in saudi arabia and this place is in kubal just look for destination 35 we have a branch in jubail have a branch in our katif at Koronesh, everywhere and we are going to reach you everywhere so this is our sitting section and i think uh to those who think we don't have loses the toilets these are the places of convenience like you see there so basically this is just a sum up of this place and i think in my videos you'll be seeing some of these nice places whereby i'll be recording my videos all right so that is it for today see you what's the temperature of milk for cotado and milk cappuccino with a cappuccino start with between 55 to 65 or 70 then a cortado it's nice at uh, 60 degrees a cortado it's nice at 60 degrees so any other question let me see
Right, so what's the temperature? I think I've answered that. I'll make a uh, lecture and raise the video that you've ever made. Yeah, I think I've answered that. Uh, Justin, I think I'll make a research about your about your machine, Gagia Vestro. Because I've used the Gagia before at a Protea hotel, but uh, I didn't know which kind, basically. Can you please make a video for temperatures? Yes, I'll make, Justin, a video for temperatures. Adventure, how are you, Sarundoji, Stephens, uh, Nantambi, Justin, Adventure, Travel, and, uh, yeah, I think uh, Brian Muzanyi. Um, Brian. So, guys, see you. Let me <laughs> start off my shift. I love you all. See you. I'm fine, bro. Yes, Sarunoji. Yeah, I'm also fine, too. This is my calibration cup, and it's giving me everything that I need, so I don't need to recalibrate. So, any customers, I'll be opening up my curtains to welcome in my customers. And that's my interest there, whereby people have a nice view of the world in Kubal. So, see you in another video. I love you so, so much.